from NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer and Meredith Vieira. All right, Al, thank you. The tragedy on the Virginia Tech campus is offering some lessons for colleges and universities across this nation on how best to protect and warn students when a crisis like this unfolds. Here's NBC's Lisa Myers. Colleges and universities are required to notify students in a timely manner of threats on campus. The federal law was passed after Jean Cleary, a freshman at Lehigh University, was raped and murdered in her dorm. Many experts question why Virginia Tech waited more than two hours after the first shooting to warn students of the danger, and even then only said in an email to be cautious. The message should have gone out at least five minutes after knowing what had happened, and it should have said that there was a potential shooter on the loose, classes were canceled. A second email about a gunman loose on campus was not put out until after police received 911 calls about a second shooting, and then it was too late. Experts say even relying on an email alert system is problematic because students on the move or in class usually aren't logged onto their laptops. Yeah. <laughs> which may be why in the last 36 hours, dozens of colleges and universities have contacted security companies that sell text messaging systems. The number of calls that are coming in um, today are totally um, overwhelming us, uh, quite frankly. Messages on bulletin boards and loudspeaker announcements won't cut it anymore. Schools now know they must be able to alert students immediately in the way students like to communicate. For today, Lisa Myers, NBC News, Washington. Alan Hill is an instructor and co-